Welcome to On The Fence. My name is Johan Manuel and today I'm going to be showing you some steps I build for my patio. Will you hire someone to build it for you or will you build it yourself? Alright, so uh, today we're outside. Um, just wanted to show you what I end up um, building about three weeks ago. Uh, we had something going on here in our backyard and um, I decided to build something um, so that the yard will look a lot better. Um, so I decided to build some steps outside. And uh, as you can see, um, it comes from the, the basketball court um, all the way up to the, the patio. And um, um, I, I did it in a, in, on a day, um, on a Saturday. Um, so, and um, I picked up the material at Lowe's and then um, ended up building, uh, building the whole thing on, on a Saturday. Um, it, wasn't, it wasn't that bad. Um, some of the, the hardest work that I ended up doing was all this uh, <laughs> river rock that I have to remove first to make a path to place those um, pressure treater wood uh, there. Uh, but um, overall, um, I think that was the hardest part, just to do the, uh, the, the rock stuff. Uh, and uh, the other things, like to build the steps, it wasn't that hard. Um, uh, I, I ended up building those up as stringers uh, because um, they, the, the one that you buy at Lowe's or Home Depot, any of those stores, those are actually um, designed for a 45 degree angle. And as you uh, might notice, this is not a 40, uh, 45 degree angle. Um, so I end up building those stringers myself. Um, and instead of the, uh, two um, steps, I end up uh, putting three. Um, there's more space. Um, uh, my daughter actually uh, loves it. Uh, the other day I saw her just sitting down there and just drawing. I'm um, painting stuff, um, so and that's when I told myself, well, that actually wasn't a bad idea to uh, to make it this wide. Um, it's four feet wide, um, which gives you uh, a good amount of space whenever you're, you're coming down or going up. Um, so yeah, um, and I end up also putting these bars, these metal bars. Um, And those are uh, two feet long. Um, so I end up uh, doing that so that there is um, that these steps are so that they don't move. Uh, so when people walking in, or maybe through all the years, um, water going in and, and whatever. But um, I end up doing that, uh, putting several of them, just so uh, it can be more stable. So, um, if you guys are planning to, to have something done like this, uh, you might ask yourself, is it better to just hire someone to do it or should I build it myself? And the answer should be quite simple. Um, it depends pretty much on how much money you have, all the, your budget, and also depends um, on your able, capable to do it, uh, to build this type of steps. Um, is uh, I spent about two hundred and seventy-five dollars for everything, you know, from uh, the the, uh, the pieces of wood that I bought, those uh, pressure treater wood um, with the uh, Trex um, um, steps and the nails. Everything was uh, two hundred and seventy-five around there. So if you can build it yourself, um, you know, uh, just just see if. Um, just go to one of those places and buy you know the product and let me know if you have any questions um, and on when it comes to measurements and things like that I'll be more than happy to provide those to you and also uh, if, if you have any thoughts of maybe something I, I could have done better <laughs> I would love to hear it just because I'm building stuff here and there so anything that could help me uh, build something better in the future uh, you know I'm glad to take those uh, those comments to uh, suggestions um, now if you're trying to uh, pay someone to do it just keep in mind uh, 
something like this. Again, material-wise, $275. Uh, and then labor, they, they end up charging you uh, same amount plus a little bit more, depending who you um, hire to, uh, to do your job. So um, was it worth uh, for me, you know, making, building these things, uh, these steps? I said, yeah, uh, <laughs> if you had to pay those extra money. So um, I'll, if I have to do it again, uh, yeah, I, it's not like a super professional job, uh, but it, it's going to last a long, long time. And, and whenever the, the, color, the, the color is fading, I'll just paint it just because of the material that I picked. And um, that's another thing. When you're getting steps done, what type of material are you getting? Are you getting um, you know, regular material? Are you getting uh, uh, tracks? Um, um, or something else so also make sure you follow me in Instagram and Twitter um, my links are up there so just um, I usually keep posting uh, pictures and, and, and videos sometimes um, there uh, just to keep uh, you know in touch with you guys and um, also make sure you like and subscribe this channel um, and uh, if, if you know someone that is trying to build some some steps uh, on the yard Send no, share the video, share the love, and uh, um, if you guys have any comments, uh, again, also just uh, leave it below. See you on the next video.